Today, we're looking at... <coughs> Today, we're looking at Lexing GTX Motorcycle Bluetooth headset. Because I got this, babe. And it's for another video. As always, let's unbox it first. You might ask, why don't you just get Cardo or Senna? I'm telling you, dude, everything is sold out. And honestly, I just need something that I can uh, pick up the phone call or hear the navigation. And for just a hundred bucks, I can do all of that with this unit. Although the device itself feels a little bit on the cheaper side, but it does come with all these inlays you can swap out. I like this one better because I think it goes with my helmet. Looking good. There are two types of clips came with the kit. One uses double-sided tape and the other one has a tab goes between the foam and the shell of your helmet. And I chose the latter because it's more secure, but it kind of hurts my soul a little bit because I have to do this to my X15. Oh well, it looks okay. Now on to installing the speakers and uh, route the wires. And there are two types of microphones came with the kit. One is wired, one is a boom mic. The boom mic is for open face helmet, so I went with a uh, wired mic. And my helmet has these pre-made slots for putting the headphone speakers in. I just need to strip it down to the speaker itself. Otherwise, due to the size and thickness, you're not able to fit it in there. And you also have these extra paddings in different thickness in case you need to move it closer to your ears, depending on the helmet that you have. For my helmet, because the cover already has pretty thick foam on it, so I wouldn't need to use these. And the cover just clips back like so. Next, remove the liners before running the wire. Here I used a plastic card to push the wires into the uh, gaps between the foams. Now the other speaker into this cozy little cutout, then put the cover back on. Next, gaffer tape the wires to the foam. Now I need to find a location for the mic without touching the liners and close to my mouth. And finally, reinstall the liners. This is how it looks like after finishing up. My Bluetooth mic is right next to my camera mic, like two little black balls. Now put my left mic in there to test how this sounds. It's loud and um, yeah, it's loud. It sounds like the right speaker has a little bit lower volume. Probably need to add a padding to move it closer to my ear. But other than that, it works. Now let's give the microphone a test. Instead of reading some generic stuff, I asked ChatGPT to write me something to cheer me up as I'm going through this period of my life, witnessing the end of my marriage and becoming a single parent. And this is what I got from it. Hey, just a quick reminder. It's okay not to have it all figured out. Life can be tough and sometimes you might feel overwhelmed. But remember, you're not alone in this. Strength isn't just about pushing through. It's about recognizing when you need support, whether it's talking to a friend, seeking help, or taking a moment for yourself. These steps show you care about your well-being, and that's powerful. Your struggles don't define you. How you face them does. It's okay to have bad days. What matters is that you keep moving forward, even if it's just one small step at a time. 
don't hesitate to ask for help. Taking care of your mental health doesn't make you weak. It makes you stronger. You've got this, and brighter days are ahead. Stay strong and know that you're not alone. My daughter made me this box when she knew that's going to be just two of us from this point on. I kept it on my table ever since she gave it to me. I hope we can fill it up with joy and memories. If you're also experiencing how tough life can be, remember, the only way is up. Thanks for watching. I will see you guys soon.